In this video, I'm going to describe the operation of the focus knobs and joystick on this microscope. So to focus on the sample, you will move the focus knobs by turning these two wheels or this wheel and this panel inside it with the divots. The difference um, between the outside knob in both cases or the inside knob on the right or the inside little plate with divots on the left is that the big knob moves it a lot, so it's a coarse focus, whereas the inner plate or inner knob moves it more subtly, so it's a fine focus. Both sides, you can use whichever one you want. People usually use the left one so that they can use the right hand to operate the joystick. They both go uh, together, so you can use whichever one you find uh, more comfortable. And because this is a German microscope, uh, in German microscopes, if you rotate the knob away from you, so like this towards the wall over there, that moves the objective up. Whereas if you rotate it towards you, that moves the objective down. Be aware that when you're rotating this away from you, you are moving the objective closer to the sample uh, and there's no stop uh, that will automatically stop you from crashing into it. So you have to have some awareness that that's not gonna happen and we'll discuss that more in the trainings. Uh, that's it for the focus knob. Let's discuss the joystick. This system has a motorized stage, so to move the sample, you will manipulate it with this joystick. As you move the joystick, you'll see that the stage moves. The joystick has two modes. By default, it starts on fast mode, but if you press this button, it is a toggle that will switch it to slow mode. You can see it moves more subtly now. Another important thing to keep in mind is that the rate at which it moves depends on the objective that you're on. So if I move it now, I'm on slow on the 5X. If I switch to fast on the 5X objective, it's moving quite a bit. If I switch, for example, to a higher magnification objective, uh, such as the 40X on the LSM 900 Tonks, if I now move, even though I'm in uh, fast mode, it doesn't move as much and it moves even less on slow mode. Um, that uh, makes it more comfortable to operate uh, when you're looking through the eyepieces. Uh, one final note is uh, try not to use the fast mode if you're on a very high mag objective or, or an oil objective. So you probably don't want to use it if you're on the 40X Air in the case of the LSM 900 Tonks or the 63X Oil in the case of both Tonks and Lupin or the 40X Oil uh, in the case and the 25X oil in the case of Lupin. Uh, the reason for that is um, if you're not careful, and you should be careful, you can slam the edge of this onto the objective and cause significant damage to a very expensive and critical piece of equipment. So just be aware when you're moving not to move too fast and keep in mind where these edges are relative to the top of your objective.